Hello friends, the story I have for you today is called A Family Mystery. Now this was also a movie, so you might know this story. The movie was called Coco. Who do you think Coco is? Maybe it's one of these people or the dog? What do you think? Miguel Rivera lives in Mexico with his big family. That's Miguel. Mama Coco is his great grandmother. Miguel loves her. So that's Coco. So that means he has a grandma and this is his grandma's mom. Before Miguel was born, the Rivera home was filled with music. But one day Coco's papa left to play music all over the world, never came back. Coco's mother is Mama Imelda. Imelda learned to make shoes to help her family. She has one rule, no music. Look at these beautiful pictures. In Mexico, they sometimes take paper and cut it into really pretty designs and hang it up. And look, this is showing he left to make music. She's learning to make shoes. Miguel's abuelita has the same rule, but Miguel has a secret. He does not want to make shoes like his family. He loves music. He sings and plays guitar for his dog, Dante. His abuelita is his grandma, so that means that's Coco's daughter. Ernesto de la Cruz is Miguel's favorite musician. Miguel knows all his songs and movies, and he wants to be just like Ernesto. There he is, Ernesto de la Cruz. Miguel wants to play in a talent show on Dia de los Muertos, the Day of the Dead. That is when family in the land of the dead visit the land of the living. So that's when you remember all the people in your family that have died. For Dia de los Muertos, the Riveras put photos of their family on an altar. Look, so they have pictures of all the people in their family to remember them. In a photo of Mama Coco when she was little, her papa has a guitar. That's Ernesto's. Mama Coco's papa is Ernesto de la Cruz. So that's Coco. Abuelita says Miguel cannot enter the talent show. The family rule is no music, and she smashes his guitar. How do you think Miguel felt about that? Miguel runs away. He needs a new instrument. He finds Ernesto's guitar and plays it. What do you think will happen? Suddenly, Miguel can see his family from the land of the dead. They are skeletons and his family will take him to Mama Imelda. Miguel needs a blessing from a family member so he can go back to the land of the living. So look, he's never met them. Those are his family members who died before him. And now he's talking to them and seeing them. But Imelda's blessing comes with a condition. That means he has to do something, no music. So Miguel runs away again. He meets Hector. Hector knows Ernesto de la Cruz. Miguel tells him Ernesto is his only family member and Miguel needs his blessing. Hector will help Miguel find Ernesto. But is Ernesto Miguel's only family? Mm -mm. In return, Miguel will bring Hector's photo to the land of the living. Hector paints Miguel's face to look like a skeleton, so he will fit in. Miguel enters a talent show. Hector plays on stage with him. But the talent show host says there is a family looking for a live boy. Miguel doesn't belong here, so his family is trying to find him to help him get back. But he wants to go back and play music, and his family doesn't want him to. Hector thought Ernesto was Miguel's only family. Miguel lied to him. Now Miguel thinks Hector will not help him find Ernesto and he throws Hector's photo at him. Then Mama Imelda finds Miguel. She says he has to choose between family and music. Miguel does not want to choose, so he storms off. He 
He loves his family, but he loves music and he can't choose. He can't pick. Miguel finds Ernesto at his mansion and Miguel plays a song. Ernesto is happy to meet his great great grandson. Then Hector comes. He and Ernesto used to be friends, but Hector is not happy to see Ernesto. I wonder why. Why would Hector not be happy to see Ernesto? Miguel finds that Ernesto stole Hector's songs and his guitar. Ernesto does not want anyone to know, so he throws Hector and Miguel into a pit. If Miguel doesn't get back before the sun rises, he'll turn into a skeleton. Oh my goodness, he'll be stuck there. He won't be able to see his family, his mom and his dad. His cousins and his grandma? Hector used to write songs for his daughter, Coco. Mama Coco is Hector's daughter. That means Hector is Miguel's great-great-grandfather. If Coco does not remember Hector, he will disappear. Mama Imelda saves Hector and Miguel, and everyone learns the truth about Ernesto. So it turns out Hector is part of Miguel's family. Hector and Imelda give Miguel their blessing to go home. Miguel sings Hector's song to Mama Coco. The whole family watches. She remembers Papa Hector and music fills their home once again. Look, there's that picture and they fixed it and that's Hector. The Rivera family love each other, and they love music, too. Music brings them all together. Look at it. Now they love music because they know that, his, that, that Mama Coco's dad didn't leave his family, but he still loved them. I liked that story because I think it's important to know about your family, but it's also important to know about things that you love. Have you seen that movie about Coco? What did you think? Did you like the book or the movie or both? I had fun reading this to you. I'll see you later. Bye.